to make you more confident, I will show you two things that I have had in for a, a long time ago. And the first thing is, if we go to my gists, those are, as you can see, 10 years ago. The fact that that is 10 years ago is somewhat worrying. But okay, let's just open the ones that are 10 years ago over here and let's take a look. So why is this interesting? Well, this was in machine learning. This is not AI because 10 years ago, I mean, it is AI, but 10 years ago, generative AI didn't exist yet. So this is machine learning and we're doing some operations. And why does this stuff not work? Okay, why does all of this stuff not work? Because in the log, something is broken over here. Um, this is not the right thing. And a friend of mine and um, at the time and me, we were sitting at this, staring at the code and not understanding why nothing worked over here, right? We looked at this. We looked at the um, the training data, right? We had the training data. We had everything. We logged every single thing. We could not find for the life of us what was going on. Basically, uh, M and K were switched in here somewhere. And that took us three hours to get. A simple mistake of a two-dimensional array where the um, indices were switched. That was the first thing that was a bit of a crazy thing. Now, this is a 2D platformer that I made with... Um, oh, well, I mean, we, I worked on with a friend of mine. Okay, so let's take a look at the keys over here. So you can get a key which has a enum key type. Okay, that's an interesting one. <laughs> Apparently, at the start, we ask what key. Why would you do this? And then what we do is we uh, we have a four ish statements saying, hey, if this is bronze, then put it to the key type. Key. What? Why would you not literally just not do this? If you just call this game object get component sprite render a sprite equal to whatever the key type is, then it's going to set that. And then right here, we have a door object over here. Uh, apparently, we need the player. I think that that's fair to get, to get the player. We also have a goal. Basically, the idea is that if you have a door, you always have to have a secondary door that it leads to, right? I think that makes sense. Then we have an in whether or not this is an entrance. I don't know when a door is going to be an entrance or not but i think i did it because i wanted to display something different in the um when you're up yeah up to enter and up to leave that's why i had entrance yes or no okay and then there's also a locked door and a locked door i, I mean boolean has lock i was i would assume a locked door always has a lock but okay locked equals true i think that that's fair right because a locked door can be locked or unlocked why we have the same enum over here um made again in the locked door as in the wait is this in the door even no why would you have a locked type like a custom lock type here again what is this yeah same same thing here right it's like key string enter into with a bronze key you could literally just replace bronze tea silver gold and special gold and that would work as well but okay but yeah those were this is like some of my code from like 10 years ago